vocals, pulsating emotion, a dynamic 80 voice chorus made up of undergraduate women and men based at Yale University. The TV series, which has been actually very nice for us because now when we go abroad especially, people are very interested in that name and uh, uh, what does Glee mean. Uh, it originally was borrowed from England in early 19th century. Uh, these Glee clubs became very fashionable. Uh, they were musical groups, but they were also social groups. Men got together to sing lighthearted songs, drink a little bit, socialize. And so when American universities started to form choirs in the 19th century, they borrowed that name. Uh, today we're really uh, just a large choir that sings a very wide range of music. Performing Beethoven's splendid Mass in C major to open the KZN Philharmonic winter symphony season. The Yale University Choir approached me and said, we want to tour South Africa and would love to perform with your orchestra because we love what South Africa represents uh, in terms of reconciliation and democracy. And I said, of course, that fits in well with our theme. The Glee Club's next stop, Cape Town. Blaine Herman, SABC News. Durban. And that's where we leave it for today.